Hi, hello, welcome to my channel Learn More Maths. My name is Varak Kumar. Today we are going to solve problems from exercise 11.2. So this is first problem. Uh, see here what he is asking. Evaluate the following. So there are totally 5 bits in the first problem. So this is the first bit. Uh, sin 45 plus cos 45 degrees he has given. So before going to solve the problems from 11.2 exercise, you must have clear idea and you have to learn each and every value of trigonometric ratios for specific angles. So we have learned a table. So trigonometric values for some specific angles. Before this video, you must watch that video. Then only you can solve very easily. Very, very important. So this total exercise 11.2 depends on the table. Values of trigonometric ratios for some specific angles. So very, very important. You have to learn thoroughly the table. Then only you can solve these problems very easily. So see here, uh, sin 45 degrees plus cos 45 degrees he has given. We have sin 45 degrees is equal to 1 by root 2. Sin 45 is equal to 1 by root 2 plus cos 45 degrees is also 1 by root 2 only. So here we get 1 by root 2 plus 1 by root 2. So since the denominator is same, we can add the numerators. Uh. So it becomes 1 plus 1 by root 2. So 1 plus 1 is 2. So 2 by root 2. So root 2 can be 2 can be written as root 2 into root 2. So 1 root 2 gets cancelled. We can get a root 2. So the value of sin 45 plus cos 45 is root 2. So this is the first bit. So next this is second bit. So see here again we have to find the value of cos 45 degrees divided by sec 30 degrees plus cosec 60 degrees. So just we have to substitute the values. So, so cos 45 degrees divided by sec 30 degrees plus cosec 60 degrees. Cos 45 we have cos 45 is equal to 1 by root 2. So just we have to substitute the values and simplify. So sec 30 is equal to 2 by root 3. Sec 30 we have 2 by root 3. So plus cosec 60 also 2 by root 3. Sec 30 and cosec 60 both are same. So it is also equal to 2 by root 3. So just we have to simplify it. See here uh, write the numerator 1 by root 2 as usual. But in the denominator 2 by root 3 plus 2 by root 3 is there. Here also the denominators are same. We can add the numerators. Uh, so that is a 2 plus 2 by root 3, 2 plus 2 by root 3. So here 1 by root 2 divided by, so first write 1 by root 2 divided by, so here 2 plus 2 is 4 by root 3, 2 plus 2 is a 4 by root 3. So see here, just write 1 by root 2 and into, so write the reciprocal of the denominator. It, here it is 4 by root 3, it becomes root 3 by 4. So it becomes a, a root 3 by 4. So finally, uh, just we have to multiply. So sorry, here it is 1 by root 2, not 2. So 1 by root 2, write as usual, into, for this divided by write into. So then write the reciprocal of 4 by root 3, that is root 3 by 4. So multiply the numerators, 1 into root 3 is root 3. And multiply the denominators so root 2 into 4 is 4 root 2. So finally we have the value of a cos 45 degrees divided by sec 30 degrees plus cos 60 degrees equal to how much it is? Root 3 divided by 4 root 2. So this is the second bit in exercise 11.2. So first problem second bit. Next we have to solve third bit. This is the third bit in first problem. Uh, see here, uh, sin 30 plus tan 45 minus cosec 60 divided by cot 45 plus cos 60 minus sec 30. So again, just we have to substitute the values and simplify. So see here, we have sin 30 is equal to 1 by 2. Sin 30 is 1 by 2. So sin 30 equal to 1 by 2 plus tan 45 is 1. 1045 is 1 
माइनस कोसेक सिक्सटी इज टू बाय रूट थ्री कोसेक सिक्सटी इज टू बाय रूट थ्री डिवाइडेड बाय सो इन द डिनोमिनेटर कॉट फोर्टी फाइव इज वन प्लस कॉस सिक्सटी इज आल्सो वन बाय टू साइन थर्टी एंड कॉस सिक्सटी बोथ आर सेम वन बाय टू एंड माइनस सेक थर्टी इज आल्सो माइनस टू बाय रूट थ्री सो हियर माइनस इज देयर राइट माइनस एंड सेक थर्टी सो कोसेक सिक्सटी एंड सेक थर्टी बोथ आर टू बाय रूट थ्री सो वंस इफ यू अब्जर्व द न्यूमरेटर एंड डिनोमिनेटर बोथ आर इक्वल सो हियर प्लस वन बाय टू प्लस वन बाय टू प्लस वन प्लस वन माइनस टू बाय रूट थ्री माइनस टू बाय रूट थ्री बोथ आर सेम न्यूमरेटर्स एंड डिनोमिनेटर डायरेक्टली वी कैन कैंसिल वी गेट वन सो हियर द वैल्यू इज हाउ मच हियर वन सो द वैल्यू ऑफ साइन थर्टी प्लस टेन फोर्टी फाइव माइनस कोसेक सिक्सटी डिवाइडेड बाय कार्ट फोर्टी फाइव प्लस कॉस सिक्सटी माइनस सेक थर्टी इज इक्वल टू वन दिस इज थर्ड बिट नेक्स्ट यू टू सॉल्व फोर्थ बिट सो दिस इज द फोर्थ बिट इन द फर्स्ट प्रॉब्लम टू टेन स्क्वेर फोर्टी फाइव प्लस कॉ स्क्वेर थर्टी माइनस साइन स्क्वेर सिक्सटी सो वी हैव टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ टू टेन स्क्वेर फोर्टी फाइव प्लस कॉ स्क्वेर थर्टी माइनस साइन स्क्वेर सिक्सटी सो जस्ट वी हैव टू सब्सिट्यूट द वैल्यूज अगेन सो वी हैव टू राइट द स्क्वेर हियर यू रीड इट इज एज टेन स्क्वेर फोर्टी फाइव सो डोंट राइट अ स्क्वेर आफ्टर द Uh, angle just we have to write the square on the trigonometric ratio tan square we have to write here only don't write here so cos square we have to write square for the trigonometric ratio not for the angle so here at 2 tan square 45 so that is a 2 into so we have tan 45 equal to 1 square is there so write to square so 2 into 1 square Plus cos square thirty. So we have cos thirty equal to root three by two. So square is there. It is root three by two whole square. Root three by two whole square minus uh, sine square sixty. So we have sine sixty equal to root three by two again. So square is there. We have to write a uh, root three by two whole square. So these are the values of a given trigonometric ratio. So. So tan 45 is 1. 2 into tan square is there. So 1 square plus cos 30 is root 3 by 2. Square is there. Root 3 by 2 whole square. Sin 60 is also root 3 by 2. Square is there. Root 3 by 2 whole square. So just we have to simplify here. 2 into 1 square is 1. So plus root 3 by 2 whole square. It is root 3 whole square is 3 by 2 square is 4. Minus here also root 3 whole square is 3. Minus two square, ah, uh, two square is four. So here plus three by four minus three by four gets cancelled. Uh, two into one is a uh, two. So this is the fourth bit in first problem. Next we have to solve fifth bit. Uh, this is the fifth bit in X uh, is eleven point one first problem. So six square sixty minus ten square sixty divided by sine square thirty plus cos square thirty. So just we have to substitute the values again. We have sec 60 equal to 2, tan 60 equal to root 3, sin 30 equal to 1 by 2, cos 30 equal to root 3 by 2. So we have to substitute the values. Sec square 60, sec square 60 is uh, sec 60. We have 2. So sec square is there. So we have to write a 2 square. So sec square sixty is two square minus tan sixty is root three. So tan square sixty is root three whole square divided by uh, sine thirty is one by two. Sine square thirty is one by two whole square plus cos thirty is root three by two. Cos square thirty is root three by two whole square. Root three by two. Whole square. So just we have to simplify the numerator and the denominator. So two square is four minus root three whole square is three divided by one by two whole square is one by four plus root three by two whole square is three by four. So just we have to simplify further. Four minus three is one divided by. So here the denominators are same. We can add the numerators. It is one plus three by four. So that is a 
वन डिवाइडेड बाय फोर बाय फोर फोर बाय फोर इज आल्सो वन वन बाय वन इज वन सो वी हैव वन सो द वैल्यू ऑफ सिक्स स्क्वायर सिक्सटी माइनस टेन स्क्वायर सिक्सटी बाय साइन स्क्वायर थर्टी प्लस कॉ स्क्वायर थर्टी इक्वल टू वन सो दिस इज द फिफ्थ बिट इन द फर्स्ट प्रॉब्लम uh there are totally five bits uh, we have completed all the five bits uh, so next we have to solve second problem uh, this is second problem in exercise 11.2 see here what he is asking choose the right option and justify your answer so there are totally three bits in the second problem so this is the first bit uh, so just like these are multiple choice questions uh, so 2 tan 30 divided by 1 plus tan square 45 is equal to so choose the right option from the four options he is asking so first a is a sin 60 b is cos 60 c is a tan 30 d is a sin 30 so first we have to find the value uh, by substituting the as a value so so 2 tan 30 divided by 1 plus tan square 45 so we know tan 30 is 1 by root 3 tan 45 is 1 so first we have to substitute here uh, 2 into tan 30, so that is a 2 into tan 30 is 1 by root 3 divided by so 1 plus tan square 45. So tan 45 is 1, <coughs> tan square 45 is 1 square. So again we have to simplify further. 2 into 1 by root 3 divided by so here 1 plus 1 square is 1, so 1 plus 1. So one plus one is two. Here two gets cancelled. We get finally one by root three. So just we have to check where we get one by root three. So sine sixty is root three by two. <coughs> Cos sixty is also sine one by two. Uh, sine sixty is root three by two. Cos sixty is one by two. Tan thirty is one by root three. Sine thirty is one by two. So here the right option is how much? What is the right option? So C is the right option. So tan 30 is equal to 1 by root 3 here. So this is the first bit. Uh, next we have to solve second bit. Uh, this is the second bit in second problem. 1 minus tan square 45 by 1 plus tan square 45. So we have to select the right option from the four options. Uh, uh, tan 90, 1, sin 45, 0. so which one is correct we have to select so just we have to substitute the values and simplify so 1 minus we have tan 45 is 1 so square is there a right square so divided by here also 1 plus uh, tan 45 is 1 square is there right square so 1 minus 1 uh, square is 1 divided by 1 plus 1 square is 1 so 1 minus 1 is 0 by 2 that is 0 Zero by two is zero, so where is zero? D D is the right option. So just we have to check the other option also. Tan ninety is uh, not defined. Uh, B is one and uh, sine forty five is one by root two. So the right option is uh, D. So since it is also uh, zero, so this is second bit. So next we have to solve third bit. So two tan thirty divided by one minus tan square thirty is equal to. So we have to select the right option from the four options. Uh, A is cos 60, B is sin 60, C is tan 60, D is sin 30. So just we have to simplify it. See here at uh, 2. So just we have to substitute the value. We have tan 30 equal to 1 by root 3. So 2 tan 30 is 2 uh, into 1 by root 3. 2 into 1 by root 3 divided by 1 minus tan square 30. So 1 minus uh, Tan 30 is 1 by root 3. Square is there. It becomes 1 by root 3 whole square. So just we have to simplify here. 2 into 1 by root 3 is 2 by root 3 uh, divided by so 1 minus 1 by 3. 1 minus 1 by 3. So here 1 by root 3 whole square is 1 by 3. So again we have to simplify further. It is 2 by root 3 by So one minus one by three, it becomes a three minus one by three. Find LCM. Three minus one by three, so that is a two by root three by. So three minus one is also two by three. Two by root three by two by three. So just we have to simplify further. I write a two by root three as usual. 
so into this 2 by 3 we have to write the reciprocal if we write into we have to write the reciprocal so 2 by root 3 big uh, 2 by 3 becomes 3 by 2 3 by 2 so 2 2 gets cancelled here root 3 and root 3 1 root 3 will be so we have root 3 finally so root 3 just we have to select where we get uh, root 3 cos 60 is 1 by 2 sin 60 is root 3 by 2 tan 60 is root 3 sin 30 is 1 by 2 so here we get a root 3 so it is equal to a root 3 tan 60 value is root 3 so this is the third bit so totally we have three bits in x uh, in the second problem so that's all uh, so we have completed all the three bits so that's all today's class we will meet in the next class with the third problem so thanks for watching